What's going on, Sheepdog Stress here, 221B Tactical. Today we are talking about our responder gloves. Level five cut resistance on the palms and 360 degree fluid protection. I'm gonna get right into it. Of course, level five cut protection, what our gloves are known for. But a lot of you said, hey, we love the cut protection, but we would love to get some fluid protection in case we run into someone that has blood, urine, or some other bodily fluid. So of course we gave you level five cut protection here. I assure you, my knives are sharp. So you have that cut protection on the palm and all the way up to the fingers too. So you have that full palm cut protection on the thumb crease as well. God forbid, God forbid you needed to actually grab a blade of someone's trying to attack you and that was your only hope you had to grab that blade. You know you could do that and pull that blade out and you see that level five cut protection could save your hand. So the fluid protection, which is something that a lot of people worry about, especially in the, this day and age with everything going on out there. A lot of guys say, hey, I love wearing gloves on the job, but you have a scuffle or you have an incident, God forbid you have a shooting, and now the person's bleeding or there's some other bodily fluid present. And you don't really wanna take your gloves off because you still want that protection, but you don't wanna switch over to your uh, rubber nitrile gloves, which are gonna give you the fluid protection that you want, of course, in that situation. Well, guess what? Our Hypora liner inside these gloves essentially are gonna give you that same thing. That blood or whatever bodily fluid you're worried about is not gonna seep through, so it's not gonna to get to your skin uh, when you're wearing these gloves. So that gives you that dual protection from the slashes and the, the cuts and from the fluids. That's why we came out with these gloves you guys asked for them. On the backside, you're gonna see a nice heavy duty material, abrasion resistance, exactly what you want. On the palms, on the fingertips, you have a touchscreen pad here and on the thumb as well. But you also have the touchscreen on the tip of the fingers, thumb and index finger, because when we're on our iPads or on our uh, iPhones, we're not really always typing with the pad, we're typing with the tip, we're using our finger almost as a stylus. So that's why we incorporated that uh, stylus style uh, touchscreen fingertips on the thumb and index finger. I'm going to do a quick demo for that. Once again, we all love demos. I'm going to try to do this here and uh, have it so, let's see if you guys can see this here. Okay, great, all right? Works great uh, and uh, is great when you're in a situation and you need to make a quick phone call to a supervisor or you have to get on the iPad for some kind of uh, tactical need or maybe even the screen in your uh, in-car um, computer screen is uh, touch sensitive. So here you go, you don't have to even take your gloves off for that. Of course, things like flashlights, easy to manipulate easy to feel that button. You don't have to worry about that because you have some really good dexterity with gloves like this, which is important because you want to be able to still be able to do your job. Are these gloves going to be like wearing no gloves? Of course not, but unless you look at our recon gloves, but these gloves are going to give you that level of protection that you want against the slashes and the fluid and also give you that dexterity that you need. And of course, for those of you carrying weapons on the job. And like I said before, God forbid you get into a shooting and now you have to go uh, render first aid. You don't have to take your gloves off and now put rubber gloves on, you're safe. Here we have a weapon, clear and safe. Okay, I'm gonna show you here. I'm not gonna pull the trigger, but I'm gonna show you how you can put your easily put your finger in the trigger guard, how easy that goes in there without any issue at all. No bunk, uh, bulky uh, index fingers or anything like that. You have the ability to get that good dexterity, get a good purchase on that weapon and not have that bulkiness that you have with some of those gloves out there where you put them on and you feel like you're wearing like a baseball glove. Here, you have that ability to for that fine motor um, as well. So that's very important to feel those things on, on your weapon, of course, but also little things, you know, your radio uh, that may be on your belt, things like that. You wanna be able to uh, feel that volume knob. God forbid you gotta hit that emergency button, another great thing. You could feel those little things here with those gloves. So level five cut protection, abrasion resistance, fluid resistance. You could even dip this glove in uh, a little cup of water if you want. There's a video of that as well, and you'll see that water doesn't go through. You have a nice Velcro closure here on the wrist and a little bit of spandex here. Give you a nice firm coverage there so you don't have too much going in here. And of course the pull tab here to help pull the gloves on. And when you're not wearing them, easily put them on a clip and hang them off your belt. So this is what you asked for and that's why we brought it to you. Responder gloves, level five cut resistant fluid protection, 
available in multitude of colors. So go ahead and head on over to the website, unless you're on there right now watching this video, and uh, check them out, 221btactical.com. And you can also email our sales team, sales at 221btactical.com. They're there 24 seven. So if you wanna make a large agency order, or if you're in the private sector, and you wanna make this order for these products or any of our products for your corporation, go ahead and give us an uh, email, sales at 221btactical.com. You can also give us a phone call. Uh, we love hearing from you on the phone. Lots of you call in with your questions. Go ahead, they're there around the clock to answer your questions. Most importantly, remember, watch their hands. Hands are what kill. Watch your six and get home safe. We'll see you next time.